Hello everyone, welcome to Ideabox Creations and today in this video I'll show you how to use the wrapper link extension of Powerpack add-on for Elementor. With this extension, you can add links to any Elementor section, column or widget in less than a minute. Before you can start using it, make sure you have the Elementor plugin and the Powerpack add-on for Elementor installed and activated on your website. To add a wrapper link, go to the page where you want to add it and load it using the Elementor editor. Now select any section, column or widget where you want to add the wrapper link to and go to their settings. For example, I am adding a wrapper link to this image in the center. Open the settings and go to advanced. You will see a tab or subsection known as power pack. Open it and you will see the wrapper link option. Go ahead and enable the option by using the toggle button and you can add the link in the field below. Further, you get a couple of link options as well. For example, you can make the link open in new window or make the link no follow for SEO purposes. And if you want to add a link to your dynamic pages on your website, you can use the dynamic tags option for the same. Just like how we added a wrapper link to a widget, you can add the same to any section or column as well. For this, you need to follow the same steps but instead of selecting a widget, select a column or section. Once you are done making changes to your page, go ahead and publish it and see the changes live. You can see that now the image and the section have a wrapper link on top of them. Let me know if you found this video useful or if you have any further comments in the comment section down below. Do leave a like and don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more Elementor related content.